marriage ni poor however iko na issues na challenges zake kama kuzoeana small fights lack of trust poor communication na shida mingi ndogo ndogo hapa na pale and just the same way nyinyi huzipitia hizi shida the morayas are not any different and that's why here are the morayas more na size 8 write down their problems on a paper and put them in a jar then when invite couples who have gone before them for dinner wawasaidie kutatua hizi shida they do this because wanapendana sana and they want to make their marriage work umbukeni what god has put together let no man put asunder welcome to dine with the morayas mwana leo tume tume change hao kidogo nimeona na kwambie nyumba na alafu nilipa hii Ona na machina ina kasmat. Ni kasa ni kali sana. Bila ku kuwe. Wewe ni mimi ndo unachukua. Ni nini? Oh, ninasikia ni kone kitetemeka hivi. Uko na moa eh. Nichukue. Nasikia ni kone kitetemeka. Leo siku gani by the way? Wanasikia hey, kuchukua karatasi. Ama tuchukue kila mtu yake leo. Ngoja, ngoja. You are not submitting. Wewe ni kichwa ngumu. Unasema mimi ni sub. Wewe ndo uliandika hii, si ndio ni mimi. Of course that's my handwriting. Bonu unaniambia Linette you are not submitting wewe ni kichwa ngumu. Is it the first time nimekuambia about about you? About? About your story of submission. Submission. So unasema I'm not submissive to you. Kama kuna mtu kwa life yangu ni meet kichwa ngumu ni wewe. Yaani for seven years unataka kuniambia kuna kitu muskia yako, mwanga tu kichwa ngumu, I don't listen to you for seven years. Wewe so unataka ni act kama so slave. So nikikwambia usubmit na kuwa dictator. No, there's a difference between submission and slavery. Wewe unataka ni kuwa slave yako. Usi mambo ya submission. Sasa wait kidogo. Hata tunarudishiana maneno saa hii. But it's true. Wewe the, the reason when you want understand slavery, yeah, submission ni, ni kama mimi sina say. Kila kitu unasema nifuate. Hii life haiwezi kuwa hivyo. I thought ni Bible hata imesema hivyo. Can you be honest? Ukianza kwa ndio story ya wanawake ni slaves, sijui ni slaves. Mimi as a man sitaweza kubishana na wewe. Mm. -mm. Unajua na nikiongea ufai kuongea as, as a man sometimes so sifai kuongea ni fatu kunyamaza you need to listen so mimi ndio nani anaandika hiyo paper so baby bacha nikuulize sina opinion do i have a brain of, of course am i supposed to be your helper you are supposed to be my helper how can i help you when i'm quiet it, you, and i you don't should, tell you my opinion i need to tell you how you need to help me then but ah. other skizi eh si unakaa hapo na na ku guide i'm the man in this family kichwa lazima ikuwe kichwa Shingo lazima ikuwe shingo. Nothing will ever change. Sometimes atusemi kwa ubaya tunataka ku kuonesha direction ya kwenye tunaenda as a family. Unanielewa? As a family lazima tu, si ndio tunajua kwenye tunaishia. And we can't nimekuambia tuwezi kuwa vichwa mbili kwa hii nyumba. So let me ask you in your opinion so as an African na... man eh. a woman is not supposed to talk. They can always talk when never nipoa kuuliza pia swa, nini kuuliza ruhusa sometimes. Sasa so... tunarudishiana mdomo. Sometimes ni vizuri kusema by the way ama unasikiza anamaliza and then una nini that submission una, namaliza kuongea unanipatia respect yangu alafu nikimaliza then unaendelea umesema lazima ni kuna ni kama tunauziana nyanya kwa nyumba babe you know what I, what seriously is happening now ni kama wanaume mnataka wanawake wakue your slaves no, but not your wives we, cannot, we are just we... elevated slaves Who said? Yes, we are just elevated slaves. So tunaongea history ju nimekuambia ukutia ni chongo. But it's true, I can't be an elevated slave. Jesus hata 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 kwa ndiko kwa Bible, ufai kunifanya slave yenye sina say yangu. You don't want me to do anything. Juzi nataka kutoa ngoma, unaniambia hata nisitoe hiyo ngoma. Unaniambia toa hiyo, utatoa hiyo. Ukimaliza yepi yepi utanipigia simu. Who is the, the man in this house? Just answer your moja. You. Good. Sasa ona ametembea ameenda. Between me and you baby, who is kichwa ngumu? He? Wase. Moraya ana believe submission ni mwanamke ananga si. Like you have to believe everything una, you believe and do everything your husband says. Even if sometimes anakufanya kuwa slave, I don't think that is fair. Anyway, I've invited Dominic and his wife purity wakuje sijamwambia because nikimwambia hiyo ndio issue watu wanakuja kuongelesha ataniambia hatafanya show so guys hiyo ndio inaendelea so hata ndio hawa amefika uuu isivunjike hii nini yangu size eta memo kuchukua job yangu leo <laughs> na kuona sana linet but situation ni kama vile amedai in most homes 
mwanaume ni kusema na mwanamke ni kutii at least that is what most want or most expect so in today's episode issue ni size eight hataki kuambiwa ama ni mo hataki kusikiza Hi Dominic. Hi. Sorry mkono wangu iko a bit nini. Okay. Karibu. Asante sana. Hey wife yako nayo. Siku mingi sana. Hey, mommy you look good. Good to see. Good. Good to see. Una ka vizuri hivi. Oh you. this is my gift. Yes this is. Oh, Asante. Eh hey, but hey, my fruit I needed fruits by the way. Come on and join. Karibu. Karibu. How are you? Thank you. Good. Everything is good. Because mi pengine mimi ndio sielewi biblia ama i don't know guys yeah. my husband wants me to do everything anasema even if i don't want to anasema he is the head and lazima ni submit clinet na understand kile unasema most men wanatumia hii word manipulatively wanaitumia to have their way which in a way is by force yeah But that's not what it means. In Amanisha, the man is the head, but in a way to lead, not to force their way. <laughs> so, ajui topic. Mm. Ya leo. Sawa. Ajui topic ya leo. So, mimi nataka kuja kaya hapa, Dominic, please. Ni mwache na huyu. Because asotiwa. Aki mi, aki you you are lucky. Inajua uyo bless mami. Because sisi tunaumia wanawake. Si wewe ni wengi. Karibu babe. Oh. sasa Dominic nataka na purity waonge na wewe tu one minute wakwambie issue yangu first hata msimwambie solution just tell him my issue first the way zenye mtaona mu explain yeni mimi ndio kianga chai asante sasa mimi kama mzai ndio mzeia mm ah tumeambiwa kuko kashida kuna ka issue Eh nyumba tunakuwa na maneno saa zingine. <laughs> Aziishi. Ni ndoa zote, ndoa yes. mingi ziko hivyo. Yeah. Sasa kuna issue moja. Mm. Nasemekana kuna verse ambayo ya Biblia imesukumwa sana. Mm. Submission. Wewe ndo mzee kusema, tuku kusema kitu. Lazima <laughs> <laughs> watu wati. Lakini wewe mo venye una react at sababu tumeitwa already hii inaonesha pride. Kuna issue. Na lazima usaidike. So mimi nataka tu mimi na wewe tuishie. Mm-hmm tuache tu au akiongea alafu pia wewe uni advice unaona na yeye aklarify kwa mfumo si amini tunaongea sura ya submission kwa nyumba kwa nini i'm the head uruke juu uende chini uite nani uende wapi i still remain the head of this house sasa hata isipokuwa na kina domi hapa ingeleta sasa ungeleta hata watu wacha tu tuende baby at least baby purity muongeleshe tu wewe kama kuna mtu kwa life yangu niwe meet kichwa ngumu ni wewe guy everything anasema even if i don't want to anasema he is the head and lazima ni submit uruke juu uende chini uite nani uende wapi i still remain the head of this house this week on the morayas dj moves issue ni size 8 ni kichwa ngumu sio submissive Nice says eight and I feel submission high five kwa slavery where can the line be drawn purity na dominic what does he dia je mambo ah buda mimi najua na ku understand yani tuko story yani tunabishania story ya 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 submission kwa nyumba na who is the head no hiyo hiyo kitu ni place nimetoka na mimi na ku understand siku kwanza hivyo ndo tumelelewa si kutoka tukoa watu hii 
jo kule ulilelewa unapata mzaa yeye yeah, akiingia tu kwa nyumba unatoka yeah. ama unakuwa busy chote anasema nzuri ama mbaya mm. lazima ifanywe lakini unajua sasa tuko setting different bana sasa hii yeah, times may change uh, sisi ni we are christians sasa kulingana na hiyo word niongea juu ya submission na kuna difference ya subjection na submission kuna difference ya submission na subjection na sidhani your wife ni your subject subject ni mtu slave anaambiwa kile anaambiwa anafanya she is there to compliment you because i'm trying all my best so may i just want to hear your opinion mm-hmm. in this matter yeah mm. you know what's happening in the net mm. you should see yako peke yako mm. the african setting mm. is that wanaume wamefunzwa wao ndio kusema unaelewa mm. mababa zetu i don't know whether that was the case with your father yes ilikuwa your relationship with your father was different with your, the one with your mom eh mm. babako akiingia ilikuwa inakanga kumeingia kabari di flani eh na kila mtu anaskata kila mtu anaskata mm. na wale wako na good relationships with their dads mm. bado si ile si ile ime, ime it's not all out bado una feel kuna tu ile kabaridi when mm. it comes to your dad mm-hmm. and now it was worse with the moms cuz you know mtu hii hajui mm mama anayekuwa kwa baridi sababu walifunzwa hivyo from when they were very young mm. that ma- mwanaume ndo kusema yeah. na haijalishi kile mama anasema exactly. anasi. Anasi. but things have changed na mimi nakuget sana mimi nakuelewa especially right now in this century na wakati tuko wana, wanawake wamekuwa empowered like right now mkiwa kwa industry na mo utapata uko na ideas zenye pengine yeye hana mimi mali na do job pengine kuna ile information napata yenye hazia party so tukikaa kwa meza we can even be partners not just at mm. namsikiza tu jioni mwanaume mimi si na say so mimi na kuget kile unasema hiyo ndo kitu kwa kwa hao yangu kabisa mo amerezwa in a way that mwanamke i think ni object ama ni kitu unatembea nayo ama ni trophy ha si, yani you guys sinanga si kwa hii nyumba na nikiongea mimi ni kichwa ngumu. But then again, kitu moja nimekamkulani in marriage, kuna vile wezi enda kama umeingia mwanaume wrong side. Unaelewa? Ka sasa kuna kitu naweza taka nisikie but siwezi kuja na kifua. Cuz mwanaume kuna kitu moja umsukuma kitu inaitwa ego. Mhm. And a man's ego, if you if you are to come to learn how to use it well, it's for your good actually. Mm-hmm. Kile ilifanya moa akakukatia hadi akakuoa ni hiyo ego and what you liked about him is that he was man enough for you mm. that is what is called ego so any time when you na kama kifua what you're doing is that you're emasculating him and i feel like yes mwanaume so yes maybe saying you know a valid point but ana feel ni kama umekuja yani umekuja ki mwanaume na unajoin there two men nilisikia mtu akisema kwa wanaume hakuna mwanaume mama ya mwingine so sasa zile una kama kifua he won't care about your feelings that yata kama kama mwanaume na kuget. Mm-hmm. Na kuget and venye unasema um kwa naume wame itumekuwa kwa century yenye hata si century like wanaume wanapenda tu kusema. Mm-hmm. Na wamepata hii misconception kutoka kwa kwa parents mm-hmm. wao na venye walilewa. Na na kugetu kisema mwanamke kuna venye unafaa ku handle mwanaume. Mm-hmm. But me honestly nimefanya everything unasema. Mhm. Unaona Kenya yote unasema mm-hmm. ile mpaka there is a way unasema vitu unaisema in a subtle way mm-hmm. una communicate in a certain way mm-hmm. una, una kuna vitu hata sasa ingine utasema uko na heshima yeah. but moraya amekuwa tu yani to dictate us for lack of a better word. Mm-hmm. Yeye anataka mimi ni submit to him lakini yeye hezi submit to me na sisemi ya submit kama mwanamke. Yaani tu pia mimi anisikize. Na venye mwana anaendelea, honestly naona ni kama na lose my personality na nda ji lose identity yangu kabisa because nitakuwa what more wants me to be. A man uh, a woman submits to a man's lead. Mm-hmm. Naye a woman uh, naye a husband submits to a woman's need. Cuz they also need to be heard. Sometimes mother maybe si kitu kubwa, anataka tu asikie amesikika unaona umeconsider hata mwambie by the way nimesikia acha hii kitu niende nifikirie alafu baadaye maybe utaata after a while ama msemo acha twende tuombe hii kitu tuombe by kesho utapata maybe aliona yani akaona 
Wewe wewe tutafuta idea yako. Ama wewe Mungu akusaidie hivi uone acha tufuate hiyo njia yako. Mm. So slowly by slowly baada ya kuhandle wakati kwa heat. Mm. The king time. Nasema acha kwanza hiki kitu tuifikirie ama acha nifikirie hiyo kitu. Naelewa kabisa kwenye domi anasema naelewa kabisa. But kama mwanaume ukikubali kukaliwa ukubali kidogo kidogo kutistia maulegee kidogo utajikuta kutoka kichwa umetoka kuwa kichwa tushingo hata Christ anatuangalilianga unaona anatubembelezanga ana, 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 ana unalewa unaenda kwa ke there's a verse inasema mm. submit one to another exactly it's not just one way mm. unajua wengine wanaume wanaitumia in their favor yes. unaelewa exactly like anaitumia mm. kukuonesha kile mimi nasema ni final so hiyo ina maanisha hauna si which is not what christ meant in, if anything eh christ ata yeye mwenyewe who is christ god is and is perfect anasema uh, uh, come let us reason together eh so, aikwange ni kama kile nimesema you know and of course kile mungu amesema ni right but bado anatupatia chance come, come let, let us reason, reason together so mimi nakupata of course you have a say bethel inet na kuelewa Most African men even if you are a in our culture most men are trained to be the head and not just the head the way we'd want it to be but in a forceful way that's how they learned from our fathers but ukienda na ujanja utahak so lazima ujaribu hata kae kusikiza because hata yamefika a certain level kuna mambo wameachieve now when you come together you complement one another we complement each other yes you are not competing kwa okay. nyumba. Alikuja kukuongezea kitu huku anayo. Kwa hivyo kuna kitu alileta kwa hiyo nyumba. Hii imeingia. Yeah. Eh, hii imeingia. Yeah. Wacha sikie vile mama atasema wataongea waseme. Yeah. Eh. But imekuwa chaos but ni sawa at least now they understand differently. Okay, me what I'm just saying is this. And I don't think I'm the only woman. We have submitted to our husbands. We love them. We honor them. We cover even their weaknesses yeah. and all those things that the Bible advises. But the husband manipulates me. I have I feel manipulated, mm. controlled, no, enslaved. Mpaka nilimwambia, do you know you will kill my personality? What will do? Mimi nakuelewa kabisa. Kitaongea na moko za hata mimi nimeona kuna shida. Mm a uh, a ile traditional mm. na hiyo itabidi tuongee na yeye sababu it's not supposed to be that way for a marriage to work he also has to come down and listen to you so i think tunafaa tuongee wengine pamoja so that he also gets the whole point sasa sawa thank you chatu pike basi apart from being your wife i'm a human being with feelings with emotions with ambitions with a brain I am not a robot. Points mbili moto sana hapa. One, ukiapproach mwanaume na kifua, atarudi na kifua. Hapo msaidiani nyenyekea. Number two, submissive na subjective ni vitu mbili tofauti. Kusikiza your wife hata kama wewe ndio the head of the home ni muhimu. Hii class ya leo iko na lessons moto. Hey! Wacha tumalizie hapo kwa dining table. Juzi hata nilikuwa nataka kutoa song. Mhm. And uh, nika feel indo song nataka kutoa. Mhm. Mo you run DJ yake career yake mimi si interfere ingi. Unless ame come kuniuliza opinion. Yeah. But he does 99% of his career yeye fanya mwenyewe. So me I, I felt this one time this particular song nataka ku release ni poa. So I went and did the video. I recorded did the video alafu nikakamkumuonyesha nikamwambia what do you think unaona so mo aka uh, aka aka jam first of all nilienda nikarecordaje song mm-hmm. nikaduaje video alafu nakuja kumuuliza what he thinks lakini hata wewe net kutoka conception ya hii idea atakaa ni ngoma sunge so, recognize the head at least to be informed at least akusaidie and you are feel like a part of this project mimi nikikuja nikwambia ndio hii nime shoot ndio iko hapa i feel good to to run to run nayo um, what do you think about it but i need your support unaanza kuruka unaanza kusema you are the head of the home and why is the issue with that by the way unarudisha sura ya muziki mo ulinipata nikiimba na vile unaendelea ni kama unataka ku dictate everything that do oh yeah si utanimaliza i only want you to help me 
support me and advise me and stand by me. So, so unafaa ni involved from from the word go. As long as unafikiria mimi ni, ni your husband. Umenielewa? So it was not making sense. But let me ask you, when you do you do your thing, unaenda una, una decide event, una I'm decide back in the house. So what's the difference? The Because difference is wewe you are my helper, wewe ni bibi yangu. Kila kitu uko nayo ni yangu. I'm the one who says what happens in this house. Even in a country, there must be a president who decides country inaenda wapi. You two have different careers. You should give her some room. She can make some decisions in her career and what she needs in that case is your support, not necessarily the final say from you. Yes, you can give in your opinion, but give her that room to also make decisions. Sababu by the end of the day, if you want her to succeed, you, sh- you must also give her room to prosper mali yako. And that way you'll also, you'll, sorry, you'll also end up being proud of her. And when you're proud of her, when she shines, you shine. You see more, you fell in love with size 8. So if you try to kill that size 8, eventually you'll kill even the linnet in the house. And that's not what you want. So end up pole pole. Huyo ndio yule baby ulipenda. I want her to be the best. Nona, no again, we cannot be two heads in this house. Kwa so, does that is me? Eh? Headship. Ni, lazima lazima an involve fast in everything and whatever. I have to at least to approve. Before vitu ziende wrong huko mbele alafu ikwenda na oh, Na she ni, approve what you do. Sometimes kuna vitu zingine za man I don't have you know as a man you know as a man I don't, I don't have to say everything <laughs> but kuna vitu na feel nataka ku involve nasema eh kama hii it's okay what do you think but i can't be saying everything i'm a man at the end of, i can't be saying nitty gritties umenielewa kila kitu nakuja tu tunakaa chini tuna whatever tunakaa chini she's my helper but i think that definition of a man okay especially inside christ i think that one is uh, more traditionally in christ yeah other than biblical because first of all kule tumeelewa of course tumetoka huko ah uh, wazai ndio hao walikuwa naingia akisema <coughs> kila mtu anaskampa akisema hivi no one was question but i think christ now has taught us something different mm. because we have been told as, as a wife submit to you but you also submit to one another in reverence to christ yeah. na kwa hivyo she was created also differently she has a certain gift in amaz where hauna Maybe even if you are a DJ here and a musician kuna vitu maybe yeye yeah, anaelewa ambaye wewe uelewi so lazima muweze ku combine the gifting so that you complement one another Unajua wakati Mungu alikuwa anawaleta pamoja alikuwa anajua nyote mko complete lakini kuna value na input huyo mtu mwingine alikuwa analeta ndio muweze ku build something better for his own glory Kwa hivyo uki, uki ignore mmoja you not build what God wanted you to build Now of course by the end of this life what I feel I didn't accomplish what I wanted to accomplish na kile Mungu alikuwa anataka accomplish Sometimes maybe idea yangu ndo itawak na si yako and that doesn't mean anyone is less than the other we are one we are growing na ita manisha nda kudharau just because ulinisikiza you are having core values is that that aliweka hierarchy mm-hmm. in a home right mm-hmm. but the way bible ime define when you unastahili kumpenda in fact ukiangalia venye uh, by we may define you are supposed to be even more serving her more and her interest than she does you because bibi nasema ya kwamba tupende mabibi zetu as Christ loved the church mm-hmm. na ukiangalia most of the things Jesus did unapata akiosha watu miguu okay he's supposed to be who is according to our context mm-hmm. ule akojua sasa kuoshwa miguu kama mm-hmm. mzai wewe ndio uko uko in charge ufanye hivi na hivi na hivi unaona Kristo did it differently yeye ndiye anajipeana juu ya kanisa he dies he washes other people's uh, fit mm. anapea watu chakula wale wako na njaa mm. yeah maybe hata anakula baada after amekula mm. so if you follow that context that would mean that what uh, mission Mungu ameweka katika maisha ya ha because she was complete when you met her mm. you just came to complement it's like merging of two companies mm. bio he nafanya hii na hii nafanya hivi but they can support one another to do more you see Mungu akiwaleta pamoja sasa hii ana envision as one kwa hivyo mo ukijiona kaa unaweza anza ku learn mambo peke yako i can assure you without the input of who helper who was here was the right one for you the perfect gift mungu alikupea who to accomplish what you thought you could accomplish and also when the bible says husbands love your wives it's not just about words like i love you na that's it i'm a gift part of it is appreciating her and for her to feel appreciated let her also feel she has a place in your life you can listen to her you can appreciate what she has to say 
and what she brings on the table. Mm. And it starts with that simple thing. Mskize, let her have her air time with you. Now, it doesn't make you less of a man. Yeah. If you want the best of your wife, mskize, give her the support she needs. And eventually, utapata kilo unataka. Ata your respect. Eh, na wasikia. Lakini nini? Eh. No, Nadia. I think yeah, the, the point of complimenting may me hit vizuri, yeah? um, you know, we, we are here to compliment each other. But when you are, I think when you are to grow, I hope you are going When you are to grow, from when you are from our dads, to mm -hmm. could duplicate because that's the only place, that's our first, uh, he's our first uh, teacher, teacher mm -hmm. basically. Yeah. Yeah. But now you are differently. Yeah. Yeah. By the way, Moraya Messi could blame. Because from your setup, Navenyomeriziwa, African men wana kwanga na yo issue. Yeah, who put down women. Lakini, ujue na niumiza. Na mina, wanataka tu uchange. Uwanze tu kunisikiza. Na uview this thing as for the better of us. Best thing ni melan leo ni tuache kumanipulate Bible to suit ourselves. Mm. I'm so happy Akina Domi will come. Uh, and they came through for this uh, now if you can. So, you know, there's that fact that what to compliment Yana. And you see, when you compliment each other, it doesn't make you less of a man. I understand that. But still, still, as an African man, I still I keep insisting a man has to be a man. Kwaza kama linet uspoguruma inyumba itakalika. So, I'm still thinking. I am still thinking, but points I'm so grateful. But a man has to be a man. A man has to be a man.